this Ron Garage Aquatics 2023. Um, this is the back side of water. This is my 16 gallon water box in the kitchen, right behind the kitchen sink. And I've had this tank set up now for gosh, about 15 months. Put this chunk of wood in it here, some serious stone, a couple of Nubius on this side. There's uh, five albino quarries in here, some clumps of Java fern. There's Vanellope von Schweetz. There's a bunch of cherry shrimp in here. There are, there's an autosynclus and uh, about 17 neon tetras. There's another autosynclus on the wood right there. And hydrocotyl Japan. Sorry, I'm bouncing all around here. I'm trying to get around the faucet. All these Java ferns came in those plastic tubes from PetSmart. There's one of the cherry shrimp. It's a really nice dark one too. Wow, almost black. Where'd it go? There it is. There we go. And uh, they've just turned into these massive clumps. So I really don't do much to this tank. Occasional water changes. Yeah, I try to do them weekly. Clean the filter. It's a little internal filter. Um, pull some plants out. I pulled a big chunk of the Java fern out last week. And because uh, it spreads really well in here. And I put some Christmas moss in here too once upon a time. So I'm going to go around. This is the front side of the water. There was a big crypt I put in here. Or in the glare. Let me see if I can turn this light off if that'll help. I don't know if that helps or not. Probably not. It's on this uh, plant jar that I have, one gallon jar. There should be a couple shrimp in there, both those philodendron and an anthurium. But this was a single crypt. And now there's a couple little runners on this side, a couple on this side, nicer, bigger one, another Anubius, Amazon sword. That's just taken over the, the plant or the, the tank. So last week I did a water change and I've had this green hair algae problem in here. So I drained the water down just, just about halfway. There's that internal filter there. And not quite below this wood because there's there may still be some on that piece of Christmas moss. There's some of that green hair algae. But you can see it on the wood right here where Vanellope is. Um, when I drained it down, I took a pipette and squeezed some uh, um, hydrogen peroxide on that. And it did the trick. And this piece of wood here was also covered with it. And in the plants here, a big chunk of hydrocotyl came out and a, just a big handful of that green hair algae. So I pulled all that out and then I dosed peroxide on these stems in a pipette. And it seems to have done the trick. I'm sure it'll come back somewhere. And next time I'm gonna have to lower the water even more and I'm gonna have to shut the heater off to do it uh, so I can douse that piece of Christmas moss also. So this is, it's been a, I like this tank a lot. It's a really cool tank. This was the first one I got when I got back into fish keeping uh, back January, 2023. So there we go. So my wife's on the other side of the tank staring at me like it's time to go. No. Cause I was gonna do this. Do. This is job of the hut, the popcorn bucket that my loving wife, my loving wife brought back from Disneyland last week. So anyway. Thanks for watching.